How drones are used for live streaming. Live streaming of videos is not a new concept in itself. People love to catch their favorite events live. The live streaming industry has been booming ever since the internet became such a wonderful success. The idea of using drones in live streaming events has been catching up and has the potential of raising the stakes further. However, with the FAA still imposing restrictions on flying drones for recreational purposes, the widespread use of drones commercially for live streaming is still on hold. This is a great feature that can change many industries, but due to the regulations of the FAA, the use of this feature for commercial use is still on hold. Live streaming with drones is not that different from offering a live stream from a helicopter. The video shot by the drone can be easily transmitted to an online streaming service like Ustream, Google Hangout on Air, YouTube Live, etc. Drones come with built in features which can transmit signals, and all one has to do is ensure that the signal connects the drone camera with the online streaming service for the live transmission of the video it captures. There are a number of drone models like DJI Phantom 2 Vision, DJI Lightbridge, and many others which are being used to live stream videos. However, the idea of streaming videos in real time is still in its initial phase and needs more research to be refined. Twitter has a live streaming app for both iOS and Android and is mainly used for streaming live videos from your phone. There have been attempts made by many users to live stream videos with their smartphones attached to the drones. These are claimed to be one of the firsts in the history of live streaming. While these videos have been very poor in quality, the attempts to stream live with drones has at least been attempted successfully. Similarly, YouTube Live offers a very easy platform to stream live videos. People have used the platform's easy settings and have done live streaming on YouTube Live through DJI Inspire and Phantom 3 camera drones. These drones were first integrated with YouTube Live and then fed YouTube Live with live footage. The problem with video streaming is that there is a latency of around 20 seconds. This latency is due to the time that it takes to transcode the video into various types of formats to make it compatible to be streamed on streaming services all over the world. The use of live streaming can prove to be a great tool in getting an idea of the exact on-ground situation after a natural disaster such as floods and forest fires. In these situations, human intervention becomes very tough and humans only get limited access to assess the on-ground situation. With drones, live streaming videos from such sites, rescuers would be able to help people more and would be able to do that quickly. The utility of drones live streaming videos can become essential in the entertainment industry as well as drones offering shots from unique angles of matches, concerts, live stage dramas, etc. We hope you found this video informative. Check out our other videos to find out what's new in the drone industry. Are you looking for the best pilots in the country to compete for your business? Go to uavlance.com. For the best rates on drone rentals or to rent out your own drone, go to uavlance.com. To find full-time employment or to bid on UAV jobs, go to uavlance.com. To organize or enter a local drone race, go to uavlance.com. To search the only drone insurance comparison site on the Internet, go to uavlance.com. To search the only drone attorney comparison site on the Internet, go to uavlance.com. To enter pilot skills challenges and earn money, go to uavlance.com. To search the lowest prices on drones on the Internet, go to uavlance.com. To learn the latest best practices in UAV services, go to uavlance.com.